June 4, 2021, 7.20 a.m., AP police arrested an organizer of Hong Kong's annual candlelight vigil remembering the deadly Tiananmen Square crackdown and warned people not to attend the banned event Friday, as authorities mute China's last pro-democracy voices. In past years, tens of thousands of people gathered in Hong Kong's Victoria Park to honor those who died when China's military put down student-led pro-democracy protests on June 4, 1989 and hundreds, if not thousands were killed. The nighttime event in Victoria Park was banned for a second year under coronavirus pandemic restrictions, although the city hasn't had any cases for over six weeks. The action comes amid sweeping moves to quell dissent in the city, including a new national security law, election changes and arrests of many activists who participated in pro-democracy protests that swept Hong Kong in 2019. Hong Kong police in vehicles and on foot cordoned off parts of Victoria Park, including football fields and basketball pitches, to prevent any unauthorized gatherings. Police said they were aware of calls on social media urging people to turn up for the vigil. Police officers stop a man to search him outside Hong Kong's Victoria Park on the 32nd anniversary of the crackdown on pro-democracy demonstrators at Beijing's Tiananmen Square in 1989, on June 4, 2021. Lam YIK, Reuters taking part in an illegal gathering carries maximum penalty of five years imprisonment, while merely promoting such an event can result in a year in jail. Police appeal to members of the public to refrain from participating in, advertising or publicizing any unauthorized assemblies and prohibited gatherings, a government statement said. At the University of Hong Kong, students took part in the annual washing of the Pillar of Shame sculpture, which was erected to remember the victims of the Tiananmen Square crackdown. Charles Kwok, the president of the Students' Union, said that the event was legitimate and legal, and that they hoped to commemorate the people who sacrificed for freedom and democracy. For HKU students, in cleaning the pillar of shame, we shall learn how our predecessors defended the freedom of expression before, and we shall not easily give up, Kwok said. Students clean the pillar of shame statue at the University of Hong Kong on the 32nd anniversary of the crackdown on pro-democracy demonstrators at Beijing's Tiananmen Square in 1989, on June 4, 2021. Lam YIK, Reuters Law Kwok Hoi, police senior superintendent, told reporters police had arrested a 36-year-old woman from the Hong Kong Alliance as well as a 20-year-old food delivery man for advertising and publicizing an unauthorized assembly on their social media accounts even after the vigil was banned. Chow Hang Tung, vice chair of the group, was arrested Friday morning, according to the Alliance, which organized the vigil and ran the June 4 museum dedicated to the memory of Tiananmen.